everyone so I'm already back with another box opening so this is gonna be an art uh, kind of doll creature thing uh, so there's the name of his Etsy and Instagram and all of that there on the top and this is what I got so a little wood face creature I'm not even gonna try and butcher his name <laughs> so you can pause the video and take that his name there uh, here is the certificate adoption certificate there so it's a little wood face and all the names and everything um, so I might fill it out later just so you can see and there are a bunch of different types you can get like the one you just saw in the beginning uh, I got one more like I guess a foresty one it had a specific name um, I might find it out later so here we go so excited I feel like all I'm doing lately are box openings but I don't box, box openings just the best thing I'm so excited. I want to just completely open it before I look at the face. I just, I want a whole overview. It already looks amazing. Okay, here we go. No, one, two, three. She's so cute! So originally I decided uh, that I wanted it to be a boy, but now I don't know if it's all this pink wrapping paper or what, but just looking at her face, I've kind of decided that I, I just, I see girl and so that's what I'm picking for. She's gonna be a girl, I'm so excited! I've been waiting a long, long time uh, to get one of these. I've been stalking his Instagram, trying to get any of the creatures of his that I like. Um, although this wood face was one that I've been looking for for a long time, so I was really excited that this is the first one I'm getting from him. I'm just showing you all the details in her hind legs here. Also deciding that her name is going to be Kaya. So I will have it spelled in the description box, but that'll be her name. Yeah, so this is the wood face non-flower nature spirit. I absolutely adore her. Here she is, and she is fully posable. I'm a little nervous about moving her right now because she is just so new and I'm just not used to the posable art dolls yet. It just I, it makes me so nervous, but she's wonderfully made and she is so easy to move. I think I'm just gonna put her into a pose real quick. I am taking her to work with me. I'm gonna put her on my desk. So I'm trying to work out a pose for her here. See kind of like what I'm gonna do with her. I am gonna uh, buy a plant for her and everything. So she has some kind of nature around her on my desk. I have a whole... Oh, look at her little ears. Ah, she's so cute. Oh, I have a whole uh, Alice in Wonderland kind of theme going on on my desk with all these little creatures, so I'm going to add her to that. She's going to be kind of part of the, like, earth component. Something you'd spot in the forest. So she's going to be with her plant. Ah, she's so cute. I think that's a perfect pose. Or something like that. We'll figure it out when we get there. You won't even be able to see her <laughs> camouflaging with the plants. So she's gonna be my little my little forest spirit. She's gonna go in the kind of earthy section I have on my desk, trying to do all of the elements there. And I think she's gonna fit right in. I love her so much. I think she is amazing. Look at that. So that's kind of my favorite pose right now. I think we're gonna go with that one. I love all the details and I love just how realistic she looks. She's gonna freak out. All my coworkers is gonna be great. So I'm bringing her outside just so you can see her better. And I'm gonna bring her out into the light. Hopefully it doesn't, um, it's not too bright in it. She, no, like, you won't be able to see the details. And actually looks much better. <laughs> so we'll stay out here in the sun where you can see everything. Look at those details and those uh, the little fun guy in her face. Everything looks so great. She is absolutely perfect and I couldn't be any happier. Can't wait to see her every day make my desk feel uh, more like home. 
So there she is. Welcome to the family.